Um, do you want to tell me a little bit about why you've come today? The condition's called brooks Beagle syndrome. Um, it started to uh, manifest in my early 20s, I suppose. Mm -hmm. It's becoming more pronounced, and I want to see if there's any new treatment or possibly even new technology that might be able to help me. OK, good. I'm going to have a good look at the skin on okay. the head and neck now, and then we can go through a little bit about what's available. Yeah, OK, perfect. Now, you might still be a little bit tall. No, this is a good height. <gasps> I'm not very tall, you see. <laughs> I could bend forward. <laughs> so, Victor, this is a combination of benign tumours of the skin. On the scalp, you've got these tumours called cylindromas, and they are tumours that are made up of part of the hair follicle around the sebaceous gland. It's different to a cyst. When you cut into a cyst, a cyst has a nice kind of juicy or cheesy material inside that pops out and has a very stinky smell with it. But whenever we try and cut into these, this is a hard, firm little lump that comes away. Brooks Beagler's doesn't have a cure as yet. Modern medicine doesn't have the one to fix this. Um, but we can manage it and we can help support people who do have this. It is a very rare condition and most people will never have met somebody who has Brooks Beagler syndrome. So you're very rare, very special. <laughs>